Greetings, Dr. Dominique Reese here, owner of Reese Financial Services, where I'm the chief financial coach and planner. I am bringing today's Tip Tuesday, which is save small amounts of money every week and you'll save over $1,000 by the end of the year. And we can do this using the 52 week savings challenge. So I'm really excited because this is the fourth year that I am offering and participating in the 52 week savings challenge. Now, if you're not familiar with the 52 week savings challenge, it is a challenge to save over $1,000 over the course of a year. However, we save every week and every week we save an amount of money that is equal to the week that we're in for the year. So for example, this is the first week of the year, we will save $1 this week. Sounds pretty simple, right? Next week will be the second week of the year, so we'll save $2. When the eighth week of the year rolls around, we'll save $8, and so on and so on. By the time we get to the 50th week in the year, we will save $50 that week. Now that's when things start to get a little bit more challenging, which is why this is called a challenge, because it starts off really easy. It's easy to save a dollar. It's easy to save $2. It's easy to save $10. It's even easier to save $20. However, when you start saving $30 one week, $31 the next week, $32 the next week, now cumulatively, you're saving over $100 a month. So this is a challenge to help you, one, start saving, right? Get in the behavior, get in the habit of saving. And two, saving consistently. Some of us are able to save with no problem. We own being savers. And there are other, others of us who have challenges with saving. We may start, but we don't finish. We uh, save based on what we have, not a particular percentage. So there are lots of barriers that can impede on a consistent saving strategy. So the 52-week savings challenge is one way to challenge yourself not only to save money, but to save money consistently. And then the thing that I find so many clients don't do, which is why some are not successful, is setting intentions with the money. Why are you gonna save? What could this thousand dollars do for you next year? So let's vision this, right? If we're gonna save every week for the next 52 weeks, this time next year, this time 2021, you will have saved $1,378. What would you want to use that money for? I know a lot of times our vehicle registrations are due at the beginning of the year. Uh, you may want to treat yourself to a trip. Maybe you want to completely redo your wardrobe. Uh, maybe you have some debt you want to pay off at the beginning of the year. Maybe you want to start investing. Whatever it is, set an intention with this money so that one, you've got something to look forward to, but two, you've set a goal that is actually going to impact your financial life this time next year. It gives you something to look forward to, and more importantly, you actually have the money to do something with. So I'm really excited. I think I'm going to use my savings to go on a cruise. I've never been on a cruise before, so that would be a great way for me to, to do that. It's gonna be very seamless, saving week to week, but it will be challenging the closer we get to those double digit weeks. Once those dollar amounts go up, you may find yourself challenged. And what do I suggest? I suggest you save something over nothing. If you cannot afford to save $30 this week, $31 the next week, $32 that next week, $33 the following week, save what you can. At this point, we're focused on behavior and we're focused on consistency, right? We all know consistency gets us results. So rather than say, oh, well, I can't afford to save $20 this week, $21 next week, and so on and so on, save what you can. And I don't care how much that is. 
it is more important for you to stick to the saving strategy and build consistency so you get the discipline of saving than it is for us to focus on the amount that you're saving, okay? So if this sounds like something you want to be a part of, please join the 52-week savings challenge. You may Google and find that it's being offered all over the net, but I love this, the 52-week savings challenge because in my community, we do it as a community. You'll get a daily, or not daily, you'll get a weekly email telling you what week it is, how much we're going to save, and I even have what's called going pro. Going pro is where you may multiply your savings by two or three. So instead of saving $1 this week because we're in week one, you may decide to save $2 or $3 if you're going pro in the challenge. So that's another way to up-level your savings. And if you do that, you'll come out with over $4,000 saved by next year. So this is a really awesome, fun way to save money um, with a consistent strategy, something you don't have to think about, and it's a great opportunity to get your friends and family involved. Um, I know my family and I have started to talk about what we could do with our dollars collectively. So maybe I won't go on that cruise if we decide and agree that we will pool our money together and make some sort of an investment or do something as a family because one, everybody will have the money, <laughs> right? If everybody's saving, then everybody will have the money so everybody can participate which is so rare, right? Usually you want to do something and like this person doesn't have the money, that person doesn't have the money, but now we're all committing to this 52 week savings challenge. So we all know by this time next year, we will have money to do the things we're talking about right now. So I find that to be very powerful because we're setting our intentions, not only for this year, but for next year. We're gonna go into next year making an investment or doing something together as a collective unit. So I'm very excited about that. Um, I'm going to post the link underneath this video for you to be able to join the 52 week savings challenge and it's actually a part of a club that i have called the thousand dollar savings club so many clients have yet to hit certain savings milestones so i want to encourage you if you've never saved consistently it if you've never saved a thousand dollars join a thousand dollar savings club and within that club we are going to be saving together using the 52 week savings challenge so this is an opportunity to get support to do it in a community and to actually save according to a strategy that can work for you if you have any questions please let me know uh, you can send me an email shoot me a message via facebook um, i'd be i'd love to support you i'm gonna post the link for you to join the savings club and get in on the 52 week savings challenge we're gonna start this week the first email is gonna go out tomorrow however you can join any time this week and you'll still be on time and you'll still be saving right along with the rest of us so i hope this is helpful for you um, again this is a great way to kickstart your savings for this year and this is in addition to whatever else you may have going on for some people they don't have anything else going on so a challenge like this is a really great way to introduce a consistent saving pattern and also it's affordable and again let me reiterate do not say oh I can't save that much this week so I won't save anything that's not what we do. When we're trying to master our money, we save something over nothing. And again, it starts in the mind. So a mindset. And then your behavior will follow. And then we'll have your outcome, which is you'll have some savings versus no savings, right? And that's the goal. So um, there's also going to be some giveaways that I'm going to throw in there. We're going to check in with each other uh, in the community at the quarter marks. So every quarter, I'm going to check in. I'm going to see who's hitting their marks. And we're going to have some special giveaways for those who are really committed to getting the results and saving and creating um, additional savings in addition to whatever else you might have going on. And if you don't have anything else going on, then this is what you want to have going on. So please share this video with someone who you think can benefit from it. Again, everyone doesn't know about the 52 Week Savings Challenge, so you may be introducing them to something that they need but have never heard of before. And again, it's very easy. You'll get a weekly email telling you what to save um, and when to do it. And that's it. So I hope this is helpful. Dr. Dominique Reese, uh, if you got any questions, just hit me up. I'd love to be a resource. Peace.